I didn't know there was uh, much IBD in my family until I had it. I'm an Ashkenazi Jew. It runs in our lineage in general. Um, so once I developed colitis, like, oh yeah, guess what? That kind of runs in our family. Focusing on martial arts helped me deal with the illness. Part of my ability to tolerate the pain and discomfort of colitis was from my discipline for martial arts. Because the type of martial arts I do is full contact. It's very painful holding stances for long periods of time or getting hit in the face or in the balls. So I got used to dealing with pain as even as a kid when I was 14 getting my first black belt and all the way through. So the pain from colitis wasn't that different for me. It was something I could kind of push through using those same skills. But then kind of keeping that goal of getting my black second black belt kind of helped me push through the disease and not just let it, you know, destroy my life, which is what it was trying to do. So I got my black belt while on prednisone with colitis, running the restroom every half hour during the test because I was bleeding rectally. My colitis inhibited my martial arts because I was always tired and fatigued, but then pushing through it kept me. It made me keep a minimum standard of functionality that I accept. And I'm a really stubborn person, so I did whatever I had to to maintain that. <laughs> Basically, it turned me from being a, a teenager who thought they were immortal and could do whatever they wanted to being an adult in about a week. You know, nothing like getting a colonoscopy when you're 19 <laughs> to really kind of change your perspective of, of life. And so it kind of made me grow up really quick and be basically an adult living with a chronic illness since I was a teenager. And I dream of having my own lab at a university, treating inflammatory bowel disease patients one day a week in clinic, and having one to two R01s, a few grad students, a few postdocs, and a few techs in my own lab, and work on mechanisms of intestinal healing, really kind of master actual treatment mechanisms and treat people with injuries in their intestines. Yes, my wife and I are She's pregnant. It was very much planned for this time in our life. So uh, she's five months along, and uh, we're due in October with a little boy. His name will be Logan. I'm hoping my kid won't have colitis. That's like, you know, the big secret fear, of course, but uh, hopefully not. It is somewhat genetic, but, you know, it doesn't mean they'll have it if I have it.